was it was fun to see him go out there. You know, I, I feel it's so good for the kid because he put so much time and effort into it. Uh, any, anytime you do that, uh, you know, you feel their pain when they're going through the struggles. Uh, and for him to come out and hit all four of his threes uh, in the first half was huge uh, for us. Uh, you know, it really spreads out the floor. Uh, you know, allows DeAndre to go to work, George to go to work on the block. <clears throat> and, you know, when we make uh, the right play, again, we had 17 assists. Uh, that's a great number. Uh, you know, and Matt have that, uh, uh, being able to space it out. You just can't leave a guy when they feel that, uh, when they get that rhythm uh, going. Uh, so j just really, really happy uh, for him uh, because I know how much it means to him. Yeah, th those were uh, <coughs> critical stops. I mean, we had to, <coughs> excuse me, had to find a way to, uh, uh, you know, to get those stops, keep that lead. We missed a couple free throws, uh, and that kept uh, kept it a two-possession game uh, when we were able to, uh, you know, to, to string together some stops like that. Uh, you know, obviously, uh, you know, when you can shut shut down a rhythm of another team, uh, it's a huge thing. But you know, to get those stops late uh, is so important. And, and I felt our guys did a good job of being aware. Uh, we switched our defense up a little bit. I thought the guys really did a good job uh, of, of locating where their shooters were, uh, and more importantly, getting the rebound. You know what, Randy? I, I, I guess the way that I approach this is, uh, you know, with our week of practice, uh, that's that's what I wanted to see. I wanted to see how our guys responded, and we had as good a week of practice as uh, as we've had all year. And you know, guys put those losses behind us. Uh, you know, they wanted to come out and win in the worst way. Uh, when this team made runs uh, on us at, at the beginning of the second half, and then to cut that 11-point deficit, uh, you know, to uh, to eliminate that, uh, our guys didn't panic, and it would have been easy to do that uh, because of our recent struggles and in uh, the losses we've had, and, and maybe didn't play as well down the stretch as we had earlier in the year. Uh, but this team, this game reminded me of, of one of those earlier wins that we had, where uh, you know we made enough plays down the stretch to get the win. Yeah, it was, you know, the thing with Melvin, he's such a smart player, uh, you know, and, and he, I thought he timed it. Uh, great, and then you know even that that next three uh, Southwell shot. I thought Melvin really uh, got a hand up and contested it. Uh, really made him think about it. Uh, so that's it, a good question. I, I mean, I, th I think the thing you do is you trust your guys. You put them in those types of situations in practice. We work on a lot of late game uh, uh, situations every day, uh, and, and you just go out there and try to do the best job you can. Yeah, Monte. You know, when when Spradlin got it going, we put Monte on him. I think Monte's as as good a defender as we have. He's he's the smartest. Uh, defender I've seen for a freshman, uh, a guy that can come in and jump to the ball and plug gaps, uh, you know, things that don't show up in the box score. But, you know, when Foster's coming off, uh, you know, 80 miles an hour off those screens and you got a guy plugging and sitting right there at the elbow and make him make an extra pass, you know, not a lot of people notice that. But Monte is so good at it. Uh, you know, he's the best we have right now. And again, for a young player to have that type of awareness out there in the basketball court is huge. So, I, I mean, if we, if we need stops, he's, he's going to be on the, on the floor at the end of the game. Uh, you know, I just I told him to stay with it. Uh, I ran a play for him out of the, uh, out of the break uh, to try to get him going. Uh, I knew he was a little frustrated with the way things were going out there. Uh, but he kept his head in the game, and, and uh, you know, to, to be able to go out there and get those rebounds was huge. Uh, you know, I was having trouble on who I was going to keep out there. You know, Melvin had it rolling; he scored over half our points in the second half. Uh, you know, George uh, you know, he really had it going offensively, especially in the first half, and he's always a great playmaker for us. Uh, you got to have DeAndre out there, Monte again defensively. So you know, it came down to I want Matt or Dustin. Uh, we just felt that we needed that defensive presence and, and rebounder out there, and that's why we went with him. That's the type of the team they are. I, I, Bruce does such a good job, uh, and, and this team is, is scrappy. Uh, I love Foster. I, I think he is big time, big time player. Uh, Southwell obviously hit some shots in the first half, and then Spradling once he heated up. So, uh, you know, it's a team that's uh, that's very dangerous. You know, they're, they're they're ranked for a reason. You know, and I think Bruce, you know, from the early struggles they had at the beginning of the season to where he has this team playing now is a big time credit to him. Uh, it sounded like he uh, he kind of had his uh, put his hand in his face. I thought it was the other way around. I thought he put his face in his hand. So, uh, well, I, I just I think he's rushing it a little bit when he's uh, when he's going in there. Um, you know, just he's a great finisher in there. I mean, he's been showing that all year. But you know, he's struggling a little bit with that right now. He had the huge uh, and one there late. Uh, you know, that I think gave us a five point lead, knocked down the uh, huge free throw. Uh, you know, but we're going to trust DeAndre with the ball in his hands. He made a great pass, little pocket pass to George. Uh, you know, he missed that three, but you know we're going to have the ball more often than not in those two uh, the players' hands. And then Melvin made a really good drive, I thought, uh, to the basket when they were playing the play that we had uh, drawn up.